This video is about uh, finding stationary points. f of x equals x to the third power minus 5 over 2x squared minus 2x plus 6. Show that f prime of x equals 3x squared minus 5x minus 2. For f prime of x equals x to the third power prime minus 5 over 2 x square prime minus 2 x prime then plus 6 prime. We know we got to use the x to the nth power prime equals n times x to the n minus 1th power. For example, x squared prime equals 2x, x prime equals 1, constant number prime equals 0. So we have 3x squared minus 5 over 2 times 2x minus 2 x prime is 1. You don't have to write down times 1. Then plus 0. Simplify 3x squared reduce minus 5x minus 2. Then for b, use the first derivative, which means this function. Find all the stationary points. We will set up f prime of x equals 0. Then by either solver or graphing, let me use a solver. x1 equals and x2 equals. Go to y equals 3x squared minus 5x minus 2. Since this is a quadratic function, we can use the equation solver. Math solver alpha trace y1 enter. Put a 10 as an estimated value. Alpha enter. So you could say x1 equals 2. This time, we will put a negative 10. Then alpha enter. Answer will be negative 0 0.3333. So we quit. Press this x, enter. Then math, enter, enter, get fraction negative 1 over 3. After we figure out uh, zeros from equation solver, we can figure out zeros from uh, graphing. Second trace 2. Left bound uh, of uh, this x-intercept. Enter. Then right bound of this x-intercept, enter, enter. You could see we get the same answer, negative 1 over 3. Now second trace uh, 2 again. Move the arrow to the left side of this uh, x-intercept, enter. Enter, enter. Same answer, x equals 2. x1 equals 2, x2 equals negative 1 over 3. We need to figure out stationary points. f of 2 equals f of negative 1 over 3 equals. Go to calculator. We put 
f of x into y2, then quit. Alpha trace y2, parenthesis 2, do the substitution, enter, equals 0 for alpha trace y2, parenthesis negative 1 divided by 3, enter. Then math enter enter to get fraction. The coordinates uh, for all the stationary points uh, will be 2, 0, negative 1 over 3, 343 over 54. Let's go to C. Find the intervals uh, where the function is increasing or decreasing. We do know when f of prime of x greater than zero, f of x is increasing. When f of x less than zero, f of x is decreasing. Therefore, we need to draw the sign diagram for f of prime of x. This time, we need to sketch the graph but only for y1. So we go to y2 and highlight this uh, equal sign. Then graph. We already figure out uh, this is negative one over three. This is a two. This is negative one over three. This is a two. So on the left side of uh, negative one over three, it's a positive because the graph is uh, above x-axis. Between negative 1 over 3 and uh, 2, it's negative because uh, the graph is uh, below x-axis. When x greater than 2, the graph is above x-axis, it's uh, positive. So we draw this uh, sign diagram, negative 1 over 3. This is 2 positive or negative or positive. This is a for f prime of x, which means uh, increasing, decreasing, and increasing. We will put a negative infinity here, positive infinity here, from negative infinity to negative 1 over 3 union from 2 to positive infinity. f of x is increasing from negative 1 over 3 to 2. f of x is decreasing. 